So that's Talk the to me three. a little more, Anthony, on your European footprint. Where do you currently yes. operate in Europe? So currently, uh, this year we started uh, operating to Prague and Vienna. These are the two destinations which we uh, started this year. So next year in 2023, we have, we have plans into launching uh, Munich as well and a couple of destinations uh, in uh, Belgrade. One of them is Belgrade and some other destinations in uh, Europe. We had operations to London. Gatwick, but uh, I mean, it was a long term plan of we operating into London Gatwick, but unfortunately, we were hit by COVID and then uh, we just stopped the operations to London Gatwick. So we will start back London uh, somewhere, not maybe in 2023, but when we have uh, enough number of airplanes, a good connectivity, and everything, we will look, we look into Gatwick. I mean, we ideally we want to fly to London Heathrow. So that's our main target. But yeah, I mean, uh, since London Heathrow is a very busy airport and we don't get the desired slot because everybody's sitting there over the historic slots and nobody's leaving the slots there. So it's really yeah. difficult to get slots in London Heathrow, especially when you have a no term in the night. You cannot fly the airplane and land in London Heathrow during the night because it's curfew, so it's closed. So we need to f figure out a way that where we can uh, land during the day and come back, which suits our network. So that's a, a long-term plan which we are looking at. But otherwise, uh, it's, uh, in Europe, we have uh, many other destinations. We are also looking into uh, other parts of Europe, like Tirana, we are looking uh, this year, next year in 2023. We might also start uh, some uh, one more destination in Georgia. So it's, uh, there is a pipeline which we are planning to. And because we have new airplanes coming in, the new fleet, inductions of airplanes are just coming in. So it, it's something which we are really looking at. So currently we operate to 53 destinations. So in hopefully by end of 2023, we will have at least, at least 68 destinations. Oh, that's fantastic, Anthony.